What's going on, everybody? Dark Sizzle and Pudding coming at you. If you're new to the channel, Pudding is hooked up over here. <laughs> What's up, guys? Try and uh, help him. But it's a gorgeous morning in South Florida. I'm all bundled up because I'm pretty cold. Come on, come on. Woo! <laughs> Broke the skunk off. That was very quick. Yeah, we're unbelievable. Up here in Stewart, Florida today. Yeah, up here in Stewart, guys, we're looking, we're looking for some bait, and we saw some fish blowing up over here, and I casted a DOA terrorized, and I caught a fish in like three seconds. Awesome! <laughs> Got a nice snook in the boat. Can't complain about that on artificial. And I just had a bite too. All right. Pretty sweet. It's a couple days post Ian. Uh, we're gonna have a great day for here, Stuart. Let's, let's get to it, Sizzle. Let's get some more fish. This yeah, is sick. Yeah, let's do it. Just let him go. Yeah. All right. Bye, fishy. I did a Brian release. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. Darcy, woo! Darcy's just getting ready to get the cast net together. And I'm just slaying fish over here like it's my job. Snooked out for snook. Oh, he popped no. off, but he was a little baby anyway. But that's fine. That was on this. Uh... Whoa! Where was that? Huge explosion right there on the wall, next to the dog. Jeez. Right there on the so wall. That was on this Yuzuri. Go, go, go. Let me know. Don't hit the dog. I gotta watch out for these Shih Tzus. You know, the Shih Tzus are vicious. You know, I used to have Shih Tzus, three or four Shih Tzus. You know, shit. The thing with Shih Tzus, you don't train Shih Tzus. Shih Tzus train you. I was trying not to overthrow it. Yeah, yeah. And get throw into the mangrove. The big school I had missed initially, but the water is very dirty, so it's hard to see. We got a lot of fresh water in the saltwater system right now, so it's just not good in general. But using my Revo sunglasses to see, it, to see <laughs> in this really filthy water. That's the only reason we could just caught some bait. Big pilch. Big mullets. There's a mullet. Here's a nice mullet. That's what they call a finger mullet. And there's pilch. Nice. Can't complain about that. No. Water's chilly. Oh, it's 80 degrees right here. Might be able to throw one more time and get a little bit more in the well, but I'm happy. Nice. Yes, we got him, we got him. We just had to throw that cast net real short right there to try and get some really juicy baits to have this time of year. Look at this. Woo, water is very dirty. Sorry, but all this fresh water is coming out of our system down here in Florida from here at Kirk and Ian passing through, or Ian. And we got some pilch. That's what I'm talking about. Throwing 10 foot cast net and we're gonna load the bait. You can open it up, babe. That's a lot of bait. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Not mullet, but I'll take it. White bait pilchards, delicious. That's a perfect bait right there. These are all perfect. Yeah. Are you on? I think I'm hooked up. Need help? Uh, another little You got it. <laughs> He's a little, little baby. little baby baby. That's okay. <laughs> is that a, some kind of different one? No. Mine is a slayer of snook. I'm a little, a little snook slayer. I got three snook today. Josh, you haven't caught one fish. Um, oh, I, got, I don't so, know what you're talking about, but I just caught like dozens of fish. <laughs> so, that's so tr true. Oh, come on, come on, baby. Woo! Beautiful. Nice Support job. the belly, even on the little ones, okay, guys? Like that. I don't want to hear you holding it vertical. Woo! Jeez. You should have kept it for a picture. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, guys. So, I'm, so I like these bait casters because I'm high level. This is actually a fresh, this is a Revo Rocket, which everyone uses. And this is a custom rod by Barrett, Peter Barrett. And I'm just using, I'm using a 30 pound leader and a 6.0 um, circle hook. Time to rig. Yeah, a lot of times, typically you want to have a little weight on there to get up below the school of other fish during a mullet run. But it's not that deep here, so I'm, I don't have one on right now. All right, they're pounding some docks around here. They're gonna leave. Is that why you just hooked them through the lip? And now uh, let's move on. Brian can't take loud noises. He has very excellent hearing. Yeah. And this <laughs> I, is way I, too extreme for him. After 30 seconds, he's got to go. It's because we're filming and, and we have mics on. It's not because of me. No, but you also have, like, like when we watch television, we're not normal people. We watch it on, like, the lowest <laughs> level. Like, you can barely hear it. You have to, like, really listen. I can barely hear it's you like right not, now. It's, like, not normal, guys. I'm, I'm short and fat, at least the good Lord gave me hearing, and I can't see. 
The good Lord blessed me with the ways of Wait, women. You said you could see with your new contacts. Well, that's, that doesn't really count. The good Lord has blessed me in the ways of women and hearing. And I'm strong as an ox. Very short ox. Like a troll ox. Like a hobbit, perhaps. I got big feet. Like a hobbit. Right. I can hear like an ex-wife. And I can, I can see like a, uh, a mole. What the? Yeah? Yeah, I'm on a pole, but I'm hooked up. Camera on? Oh, yeah. Getting yeah nervous. I just put this down for two seconds. Good job. I don't know what it is. It's not big. It's coming this way. Mine just got nervous. What do you got? Oh, nice snook. Need the net? Nice fish. Woo! Need to go over? I actually loosened my drag a little bit because I had a tight climb around a dock. Feisty little guy right there? Yeah. Jeez. The current. <laughs> he won't give up. <laughs> All right. Let's let him get him in. Woo! Nice Whoa, fish, He's a bigger right? one. Nice. In the corner of the mouth. Really pretty fish too, you see that? And the circle hook is literally just gonna pop right out. Was no. he like 25 maybe? Yeah, 23, 24. Let's see, take a look. Oh, <laughs> so let me look. oh he is nice. All right, good one. Nice one. All right, one. so it's like four or five stooks so far. Yeah. <laughs> Not too bad. Not too bad, I just lost the fish too. Nice, all right. Cool. All right, all right let's put him back. Yep, let's look right. up. Look at all this suddy water. That's the spillway water they're letting out. There he goes. Sweet. You guys are just finding places with current, and uh, that one he put on the top. I didn't have a weight on, but see, just just docked with current, and we got a full moon coming up. So there's a lot of current right now, so it's good. Eat it. Come on, something's on it again. Taking it to the freaking piling. He's on. Woo! Got him out of there. <laughs> oh no, it's a catfish. Oh, you sticking fish, dude? I thought that was a snook. So in other words, I caught a bunch of snook That's and you caught hilarious. a catfish. Is that what happens? That is hilarious. You terrible person. Wow. <laughs> you acted like a snook, man. To you, because you're not you're from, as used to catching them as I am. Ew. And I'm hooked up again. Really? Yeah. I'm going to lower my drag a little bit again. Whoa, nice little jump from that guy. <laughs> you did it backwards, upside down, flip. Love the outgoing tide. Outgoing tide. We always catch fish on outgoing. We can't catch any fish on incoming, but outgoing. We can't catch fish on incoming. Whoa! Oh, tarpon, tarpon, micro tarpon. Woo! He's still on. Oh, come on, stay on hook, stay hook, stay hook. Cool. So cool. He's coming to the boat. Whoa! Oh! Sick! He's gonna jump again. Oh, beautiful tarpon, y'all. Check that out. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh! I almost jumped in the net. Or he jumped out of the net, literally. Literally. He saw the net, he didn't like that. All right, with a little tarpon, we're gonna bring him in the boat real quick and get the hook out and let him go. You can do that with them. Holy how the, how smokes! That, I don't know how he got out. He sees the net, baby. No, I had it totally behind him. Yeah, he sees it. All right, I'm just gonna bring it right, his head right into it. Oh, I scooped wow, him get, get, get him in. Get He's him still in. jumping a lot. Really, really All right, be really careful, really careful. Really flippy. Baby, 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 I need your help. So pretty. Look at it, guys! Look at my micro tarpon! First tar little micro guy like this is Stuart, but let's get him in right back in the water. Yeah. All right, guys. Let's let this gorgeous tarpon go. Got his mouth wide open in that current. There he goes. Just shook right off. Epic! All right, Brian, what do you got to say about that? Let's make sure my coffee didn't drop. I was about to be so mad. All right, so I just want to mention real quick that we have a, we have a giveaway. We're going to mention it at the very end of the video. Yes. Okay, we actually have two. I'm not sure. Maybe I'll tell you about both or just one. But they're great giveaways. You're going to love them. It's catfish. No, it's baby snook. Oh, it might be a fat snook. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a, come on, buddy. Yeah, it's a sword spine. Is it? Yeah. All right. 100%. 
Well, I don't know if you guys knew, but there's like three, how many, the three or four, four types of snook? Four different types of snook. Regular, this so it's snook fine. just tried to eat this bait. You could see that he was just kind of holding it in his mouth and playing with it. Bait's still alive. You can clearly see pretty much, I mean, I catch a lot of snook, I'm blessed to, but I could tell right away by the body shape. Look at his, his spine, his dorsal fin too. It's just super pointy and yeah. sharp in this shape right here. Sword, sword, sword spine snook. They don't get very big. I mean, the rest of the snook species don't get very big compared to the common snook, which is the one you guys are used to seeing us catch. Let's let him go. He's so pretty. Really golden. Whoa. <laughs> feisty snook today. All right, let's catch some more fish, guys. Now, see, Darcy keeps on saying the fish are very feisty, but it's just because the current, okay, guys? The current gets the fish excited and moving, okay, because it gets the bait moving. So, again, if you're fishing inshore with no current, you're wasting your time. Got eight. Swimming forward with it, it might be a tarpon. It's a snook. And he's off. No, he's not. It is a snook. You were right. Snook swim forward. It looks like a it's time, a... Go a lot ahead. of times the snook will swim forward with it. Oh, the tarpon did the same. Oh, did he? Well, yeah. whatever. They swim into the current sometimes. Woo! Whoa. Feisty dude. Jeez, jeez, Is that another geez, one of those Chill, things? buddy. No, no, no. It's in the common. Chill, buddy. Chill, buddy. Chill. All right, another snook in the boat. There he is. That's like, See that? I don't yeah, even know. Snook number me. 10 on the boat. Where's yours? Bye, buddy. I'm gonna cast out here really quick. That's where I caught that big snook last time. But that's where I caught that big snook last time, out in the deep water. Whoa. Oh, that was me. <laughs> the top blew up right here. Yeah. Pretty sure. I'm hooked up. Hooked up. Woo! Jeez! I don't even know how many that is. We're moving because we're trying to catch some bigger fish. Yeah, we've had plenty of fun with some snook, but now we want some bigger snook or some other fish or whatever. No complaints though. <laughs> yeah. Maybe let's find some stone crab trap bait. No, but the, the guy with the boat. Oh, hooked up! Woo! We hooked up again. Added another weight to that, and I caught a fish. Because the current is ripping. And it's just going faster and faster and faster. That is another sword spine. Nice. Look at that, guys. Slightly bigger. All right, that's pretty cool when you catch more than one sword spine in a day, or a different snook species. Cute little guy. Now you can really see it when they get bigger. You can just see how the face shape is just way larger, and then they got that really pointy dorsal fin and these little short five fins and the little tail. All right, let's let them go. You're good, right? Yeah. Woo, he got him. <laughs> oh, here we go. He it's just hot ate. right here, man. He just ate, he just ate. It is hot. He's on. Oh, he spit. You <laughs> son of a gun. <laughs> they are active. So this is what happens. Woo, he just picked it up. Eat it. Oh my gosh. We're on. <laughs> Feisty. All right, I'm gonna try a mullet now. Woo! Another snooky. Let him go. Okay, that's a good release. That's pretty much instant right here. Whoa, that's a nice fish. Nicer fish. Much nicer fish, Brian. Good job. Got me around something. Uh oh, baby. Lift him out. Slow lift. That was a nice fish. All right, I'm letting him free spool. He got me around a pylon. There you go. There How you, you go. Right you saw him. He's around two pilings. Keep going. Pull him out. You're coming in this way. Yep. He's right there. You're going to pull him around the corner. There he is. Off the corner. Nice. Got him. Got him. You got him. You got him. No, I Get don't. Get him off. Shoot. He went, back on the, he went back around the other one. Back. Can we go oh, down I think I got him. Can I think we go I got down him. Straight? I think I got him. You got him. You got him. Good job. Well, because sometimes it just takes patience. You ain't got no choice. All right, well, I don't know how bad the leader's destroyed right now. Leader's destroyed. I think it was mostly on the braid, but I don't think he's the monster or anything, but. Nice fish. Nice job. Oh. 26er. All right. Nice job. That's a river fish. Yeah, you're all banged up on your leader, but that's okay. My rod's going off over there. Brian did perfect right here in the corner of the mouth. 
That's a nicer fish. I saw it air out the second it ate Brian's bait, and then it took him around two pilings. The fish wants to jump. Oh, how long? You think he's not, he's not 28 right now? No, no, 25, 26. All right. Nice fish, though. Good Biggest night. of the day. Good job, Brian. Sweet. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Whoa! Jeez. <laughs> fish are aggressive. There's a whole bunch of them sitting in between us and the dock. Yeah. And I just reeled it in nice and slow, and he just boiled on it. Water's cold. Water's not cold. She just said the water's cold. Water's cold this time of year. It's bikini weather, Sizzle, don't you know? I know. Right? Isn't it? Uh, almost. The water temperature is 79.9. It's cold. <laughs> Anything under 80 is cold. It's, it's 1.0. You gotta make sacrifices for your fans and your boyfriend. Am I right? I'm putting my jacket back on for running to the next spot. It's very selfish. It's cold. I just, that's selfish. It's chilies. <laughs> Sound like you, like a baby. It's so cold. Ryan has his jacket on still, meanwhile, and he's telling me to put a bikini on. They, they, every time I get a comment on YouTube, it's like, put more clothes on, put more clothes on. Oh my God. Except for you purrs wanting to wear a Speedo like Doris a bikini. I don't know what's wrong with you people. You're gonna get a, a pudding calendar one of these days and you're not gonna like it. The only person who thinks I'm attractive and funny is Darcy. She has a mental disability. Darcy doesn't care about looks. She just likes loyal, loyalty and stability. That happens when you have divorced parents, which I do also. All right, Sizzle. What are we doing at this bridge? Why are we, why are we moved to this bridge? Look over some bigger fish. Bigger fish. So we caught, we, caught, we caught every 20 inch snook in town. Yeah. So caught a me, micro tarpon, micro sword spines. Then you caught a catfish, remember? Catfish, no jacks. <laughs> no jacks, jacks are dumb. Uh, so anyway, I'm gonna try and catch a slot under this bridge, see what happens. Don't jinx it. You know, I jinxed it, and if it, if it happens, then I'm the superstar. Woo! I'm on, but he's wrapped in the pilings. It'd be a miracle if I catch him. So we left Got fish to find bigger fish Got the bridge, out. and that was a total failure. We're back. And now we're back. To catch your micro snookies. It looks like it's another sword sign, actually. Nice. Dude, we've never caught this many snook in one day. That's a sword spine. That, <laughs> that's an official record. Three sword spines in one day. Yeah, that's great. That's, you know, we're having, cool. It's having a great day out here, as always. Yes. There could be a big fish swimming by. I mean, you caught a tarpon which is pretty special, so. That's pretty cool. That makes the day, you know, so anything else we catch is gravy. Make sure you follow Dar Sizzle on Instagram. She's over here making her Instagram stories and reels and- Sword signs. Look, all that stuff. Look guys. Very important. Not a common, it's a sword sign. Just let them go. And TikTok, don't forget. TikTok. We post so you different- you show these people? We got, post different content on all our platforms. There he is. Come there you go. Woo! Something made it. All right. Over yeah, here. he's swimming with it right here. Where'd you cast it? I just dropped it right here. <laughs> Outside the boat. There's fish after fish today, guys. I think we found the, the, the mecca of sword spine book. It's another sword spine. Dude, we'll there's a right school here. of them right here. Very hungry, very hungry. Oh, somebody's got a fish on. We're wrapped. Stop that. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, that's me. You got a fish on. Real. If you can. I got your fish. It's a nice little fatty right there. Oh, it's a big sore spine. Holy smokes, he just jumped in the boat. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this fish, y'all. Sick, Brian. Big fish out there. Nice. Big sore spine. That's as, as big as they that's get. That's as big as they get. So what I did it was I put one on a weight out there more and channel. I that's, was doing the same. That's what Darcy put a lunker last week. He was copying me. I was copying you. Look at Brian's fat sword spine. Beautiful. Now you guys can really see that difference. Does not look like a common snook at all. And this is a big, big sword spine. Let's yeah, let him go. Beautiful. Nice one, Brian. Nice. That's a fat fish. Nice fish. He's already biting my thumb. Ready to go. Woo! Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. Good job. High five. No. no. High five. Wet hands. Fish hands.
fish hands. Now we gotta untangle the mess. All right, back out to the same spot for me. And uh, I got the new, this is the Akuma Azores, it's like a 6,000, and I'm using their Silver Slayer Rod. It's their new tarpon series. We really like them. Not too expensive. Gave one away a while ago. And don't forget, we got two, I'm gonna tell you about two giveaways. You guys are smart, you guys can handle it. Think they can handle two giveaways at once? Yes. I think you can. All right, I'm putting my bikini bottoms on, okay? Start to put your bikini bottoms on, everybody. This is not the time to start, change the channel. Stay tuned. And I usually catch a fish once you change the drawers, as you know. No, I usually catch a fish. <laughs> this also has no drawers on in the middle of the channel right now. I would fish, I was you, I would just fish Stuart. I'm just telling you, there's opportunities here. And don't bring binoculars. And don't bring no binoculars allowed to Stuart. Nice job, though, Sizzle. We made it. Woohoo! Awesome day on the water. We yeah, awesome. We caught so many fish, both of us. That was insane. That was a lot of fish for inshore. I usually don't get to catch that many for fish. For six hours, you know? That was like pretty awesome. I think I caught at least 20 fish. <laughs> Maybe I'm, you too. I could we caught quite a few. It was awesome. The tarpon, of course, the highlight of the day. Yes. Although, so so let's tell you about the giveaways. Yes, there's two. Go. Me go first? All right, the first giveaway is a Smith's Products giveaway. Here's the stuff we're giving away. It's like two knives and five sharpeners. Or, no, three sharpeners and two knives or something. Yeah, very easy to enter. Yeah, so you're just gonna give us a, your email. That's mainly because we want you guys to get on our email list, okay? Because we send out all kinds of deals, send videos out early, yes. get updates with new stuff, all kinds of great stuff. So uh, sign up for the giveaway and um, and win some free stuff. And the other giveaway, Sizzle, is what? Is with Hair Club. They're doing a massive giveaway as well. Um, we're going to link that information down below so you can read the rules and the regulations uh, because certain areas... No, it's, it's all Florida. If you're in Florida, I apologize if you don't live in Florida. Okay, so there you go. But if you're in Florida, Exception. you can join in. Right, nobody uh, else. You can enter the giveaway, and the giveaway is for what, Dar Sizzle? Do you win a fishing charter with us? Fishing full trip. day on the water, deep sea fishing. Right, uh, with controlled chaos, which you've seen in the videos all the time. Yeah. And we're going to go fishing. Yeah. And uh, so uh, Hair Club, again, is for people with hair, like Darcy and I. Yes. Or if you need hair, or yes. if even helps you know, can't the patients with the wigs and the full service yeah. salon right all they're, everything they're known as a hair replace replacement you know service but at the same time they help all of us like Brian and I have a full head of hair yeah for men and women so, hair and or no hair ext treatments but anyhow there you I'm go <laughs> all right guys thanks so much for watching until our next adventure follow, follow your, your dreams, dreams and keep, keep on, on catching. catching we gotta go home and post the next YouTube video right now yes here we go I guess we gotta do the work never ends never ends check out the next video